call the Honourable uh, Theresa uh, Canberra. Thank you very much, Cam. And uh, I'd like to also make some acknowledgements. Uh, Honourable Tim Nichols, uh, Queensland Treasurer, Minister for Trade and State Member. Uh, Councillor David McLaughlin, then the presiding officer and councillor of the ward of Hamilton. I'd like to also acknowledge Angie McPhee, president of the Rotary Club of Hamilton, and thank the Hamilton Rotary Club for all the fantastic work that they do here, uh, every citizenship ceremony. And also uh, Maria Armory, uh, representing the Department of Immigration and Citizenship, and uh, she's representing the, uh, the minister here today. And Ken, thank you for your wonderful emceeing. And to all of the awardees today, and to all of their families and friends who've come out in this, what is normally a sunny Australia day, but um, I think you'll remember this day for a very long time. What Councillor McLaughlin didn't tell you about these plans is that, um, Tim Nichols, myself, and he will be inspecting them in a year's time to see if they're flourishing like all of you are flourishing in your new home here in the north side of Brisbane. But all jokes aside, it is um, a wonderful occasion that we have you here today. And um, it's an important decision when you decide to be an Australian citizen. Uh, has Councillor McLaughlin said 17,000 people are taking this pledge today? and 5,000 are coming from Queensland, right here in our state. And there are 121 nationalities today. And in Brisbane alone, there are 38 citizenship ceremonies. And today in Brisbane, um, some 3,337 people will be taking that pledge. Um, lots of people have different views about Australia Day and uh, what it means, um, what's an Australian identity. But one thing you can be sure of, Australians are one of the most welcoming countries in the world and we are a harmonious country. We've accepted many, many immigrants from around the world, um, including I, who am a second generation person born of an Italian family. But becoming a citizen is a huge decision and not without sacrifices. Many of you will have left family and friends at home uh, to embark on this new and wonderful life. And if there's any message that I'd love to leave you today is to get involved and Rotary is a per I'm not doing an ad just for Rotary here. Community, or though they would love you to join them. Um, there are many community organisations and you get back as much as you put in. This country will deliver back to you in spades what you put in. It's an important decision to be a citizen. It's, you're, you're becoming part of a club. Um, and, and welcome to Club Australia. And it includes also our Indigenous and um, traditional owners whose culture dates back to more than 40,000 years. And it includes many, many races, many, many ethnic races, many religions of the world. People from all over the world have made this wonderful, wonderful country, Australia, their home. And our multicultural success is based on the fact that we have incredible diversity. Where more than one in four Australians were born overseas. We're the most successful country in the world, and I'm very proud and privileged to work in this area, and I've worked in this area in the past in immigration as Assistant Minister for Immigration, and I continue to work in this area as the Shadow um, Parliamentary Secretary um, with citizenship. I was watching the Australia Day Award recipients today and was absolutely inspired by the address by the Young Australian of the Year, who's an Afghan um, person of a, who came from Afghan, he's an Afghan refugee, and um, they asked him what, it, what, what was being Australian meant to him and how Australia um, had, how his journey to Australia had begun. And he spoke of the incredible generosity that neighbours next door had given their furniture, that one of, their, one of his next door neighbours had offered to tutor him in English. This stuff has been going on since Australia has accepted immigrants. We are a very proud nation, we are a very generous nation, and we should never ever forget that that, that is what Australians have been doing for centuries. We welcome 7.2 million migrants from all parts of the globe, and no, nowhere is this more true than in my own home. I mean, I'm a, I'm a second generation of Italian descent. I'm married to a person of Irish descent. My daughter's engaged to a Greek boy. My son is going out with a lovely girl from India, from the Jaipur region. So we deal with complex resolutions every day. We don't need the UN, we deal with them at home every day. We have complex resolutions, don't we? 
Um, and it's wonderful to see so many of you here today. I just want to thank you for becoming Australian citizens. Today is a very special day, not just for um, you, but for all of the Australians who've come before you and all of the Australians who will come after you to become citizens. And it will stay with you for the rest of your lives. Uh, being, an being an Australian is a great honour. Uh, it also is a great responsibility and uh, Councillor McGolkin went through those responsibilities earlier. You are part of one of the greatest nations on earth. Welcome and congratulations and welcome to Club Australia.